Welcome to part four of Zelda, Link's Awakening. Let's see, um, I think I gotta go this way first. Yeah, gotta get the Shy Guys from Mario over there, so I can get a little key. This is all coming back to me, I'm like remembering everything now. Actually, I could use, well, I can do it here. I was gonna say I could use some of that goodness right there. Oh. Thank you. You got a small key. Yeah, well, it's not the... It's not the size that counts. It's how you use it. Giggity. Alright. Oh my god, speaking of giggity, did you fucking see Family Guy? That Brian and... St I'm, I'm so sick of those two characters, Brian and Stewie. 150th episode. It's like the worst episode ever. <laughs> Worst episode. Oh, come on, Link. I can't wait till I get the damn thing and you can stop telling me how heavy the pots are every time he goes near one. Oh, come on, Link. Dorp! Alright. Ah, I'm awesome. See if I remember that well, and oh no, no strategy. Just hit him. Those days are dangerous. Oh, give me, give me! I want you. Thank you. All right, if I remember correctly, which I believe I do, the uh... yeah. Yes, the, uh, fucking thing is nearby, the bracelet. Now, I think this is one of the stages where I should do that, because I seem to remember it tells you something about it. First, the imprisoned Paul's voice, last, this. okay, all right. There's a certain, um, room where you gotta defeat the enemies in a certain order, and certainly going to do that, and I will be certain. <laughs> 20 rupees. Joy! You can tell this came out in the Ren and Stimpy era. All right. Ah, that's a tough now, are you now, booze? Another Mario enemy. There's an awful lot of them. There it is. Power bracelet. At last, you can pick up pots and stones. All right. But before I go picking up pots and stones, let me... Oh! Well, that was lucky. Stupid eyeball sucker. I want to go back this way. Something at the beginning, which is probably something stupid like rupees, but you need all you can get. Yes, very nice. Nice! What's the crime? She's not doing it to me. <laughs> no, I, I didn't need that. Oh, fuck you. And now, if you would believe it, there's even piranha plants. I want that. <laughs> well, damn! <laughs> that didn't exactly work out right. Alright. Alright, first the imprisoned Paul's voice, which... Unfortunately, I can only beat him by chucking one of these things at him right now. Fuck you. And the bat. Oh, come back here, Betsy. And then this asshole. You'd never know there's a secret there if you didn't read the slab, so that's... Well, I guess you'd know there's a key there, and you'd try and figure something out, actually. Yeah. Oh. I'm missing a key. Yes. Alright, now I need to... How the hell... Oh yes! Oh yes! Oh! Didn't have the friggin' Rook's Feather on. Like I've said, it's been a while since I've played this game, so if I'm a little rusty, deal with it. There we go. 
damn it. Alright. Rock and or roll. more weight, because that's totally heavy, Doc. Alright. I think I gotta fight the clown now. Ho, ho, ho. I'm your bad guy this time. Ho, ho, ho. You're in my world, bitch! No, I, I need the bracelet. I remember this guy being somewhat of an asshole. Yeah, yeah, you can't hurt me as long as I have my bottle. You really shouldn't have told me that. Why don't you telegraph your weakness, stupid asshole? Yeah, fuck you. And then he tells you again. Yeah, yeah, you can't hurt me. He's not gonna have any butt, uh. I'm a fucking dork. Yeah. Lazy eye motherfucker. Fuck you! And then he'll tell me again just for posterity. Is that your bottle, you freaking asshole? Gee, I wonder. Up yours! Wah, you, you broke my bottle! Why, you, you make me hopping mad! Sure, that makes sense. Now nah, it's actually good to have that. Nah, <laughs> asshole. So much for level two. And I got a heart. I get lots of heart. And there's the conch shell thing. You've got the conch horn. Thanks a lot. Shit. Prairie, prairie. The prairie is waiting. The prairie. Go to the prairie. There's something at the prairie. No TV and no beer. Make Homer something, something. Actually, let me uh, go this way. It's faster. Actually, wait. I think it might actually be faster to go down this way. Yeah, yeah. Quiet, Jody. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. Stupid rocks. Woof, dig, dig, woof. Yeah, I uh, don't have a shovel. And there's something about that later. I, maybe I'm wrong about coming this way. I, maybe I just want to explore. Yeah, yeah, I get it, I get it. I don't have a shovel yet. Oh, I'll worry about that some other time. <laughs> I'll be coming back there when I get my shovel, Jody. Got my bearing cemetery, Uku yeah, the prairie. But I believe the prairie does connect directly to uh, the uh, town. Yes, here we are. See, Ukuku, and then the animal village. All right, take you back to your insane owner, worst pet ever. I mean, help me, but come on, who keeps a chain shop? Ho, ho, ho. Why does everybody say ho, ho, ho in this? I really appreciate what you did for my poor, precious Bow Wow. You're such a nice boy. How can I ever repay you? I know. Smooch. You got a reward from Madame Meow Meow. L lucky. Yeah. And she fills up your life, ironically. Which is, you know, a bit bizarre. All right. Almost out of time here, but I guess I'll head towards the direction of the prairie. Actually, I need a shovel, so I might as well do that now. 
Yes! Give it to me, I need the shovel! Deluxe shovel, as opposed to those regular shovels. Seems expensive. Well, unfortunately he can price gouge, because he's the only shovel salesman in the world. Which is why I can guess he can get away with calling it a deluxe shovel. Stupid asshole. I hate those guys. Alright, well... I want to see what is over there. I forget what's over there. He's telling me to dig. Woof, woof, dig. You stupid bitch. Well, but I'm going to stop here, so I'll see you tomorrow with two more parts. Peace out, motherfuckers.